Katie's Hair Routine. For dry to oily hair. Howdy y'all, it's Katie and okay, yeah, mm -mm, I need to address something. All Steelers fans out there, guess who won last night? Yeah, Packers! Okay, I'm gonna stop this because people were telling me I was going a little overboard on my football. <laughs> last night for the Super Bowl, I went to my friend's house and his house is like amazing. We went over there and like him, me, um, and a couple, like some other people watching football in his basement, um, and I totally understood everything that was going on. How about you guys? I don't know, um, but girls can be good at football too. Thank you very much. I mean, I'm a little rusty. My friends are a little better at me that I kind of have to ask, like say, hey, yo, uh, what's going on? But like most of the time, I can get the gist of it. Um, so today I'm doing my hair routine. I feel like the bottom half of my hair looks lighter than the top half. Is that better? I filmed this on like HD camera earlier but um I really did not like how it washed me out like this one's washing me out too but honestly guys I just it's hard being pale and filming videos because you know the lighting is always messed up and the garage door keeps on going up and down up and down up and down because I'm right above the garage I'm eating goldfish and drinking apple juice I'm gonna do my hair routine video because the last one I did was back in summertime um so everyone's been asking me what i've been using in my hair because i mean it looks shiny it looks healthy no this one everything's backwards Whew. one two three five hair products i'm gonna show you guys that i like to use this is all like washing of the hair i might do like actually styling hair products and stuff later but this is just the basics for right now the first things that i use almost every day this is my this is like basics hair stuff. Um, nothing really special, just my basic shampoo and conditioner. Pantene Medium Thick Hair Solutions Dry to Moisturize. Um, I like these. Twinsies! They're twinsies! They're for medium to thick hair. They have the thin one too. I don't even know if they have a, like, a thick, thick one. Um, but my hair is like medium thick. I had my hairdresser thin it out so it's easier for me to style because honestly if you guys have thick hair I mean all you guys have thin hair but like what why you thinned out your hair that's terrible but it grows back and um all you guys with thick hair knows it's really really hard to style thick hair um honestly like I mean flat ironing it's just too much to handle and I use this every day almost um but usually twice a week or maybe three times a week, depending on when I shower. I shower, um, well, I shower every day, but I take, I wash my hair um, every other, but sometimes I do, like, every day, depending on if I sweat that day or whatnot. Um, it really depends on you and on your hair glands, because everyone's hair glands and hair oils is all different. I'm not going to sit here and blab about how important it is to wash your hair every day, because you guys have heard it. If you don't decide to listen to it, it's not my you know, my, not my place to tell you what to do with your hair. If I feel like I'm getting an extra gunk back there, I have three different shampoo slash conditioner options that I use. And actually, this is the one, usually um, I do this. So usually, the first day I use these two, just as normal, you know, normal, blah, blah, blah. Next day, I'll do this, this combination. And this is the Herbal Essences Degunkify Tingling Deep Cleansing Shampoo. And this is... Um, this one. And if you guys saw my haul, I bought this in my haul. Um, so it has a twin. This one actually fits together. Isn't that kind of weird? No, wait, wrong way. Okay, how do I do this? Momentarily. Okay, they kind of fit oddly like that. So drama clean. As in like drama queen. This is drama clean. And I, that totally freaked me out because I didn't realize that before. Um, these are actually clarifying shampoos. So you do not want to use these every day. That would be very bad. Very bad. Strip your hair of all of its natural doodads in there um and that would be really bad you don't want to have unnatural and gross hair so you don't want to use this every day but this is really great you're definitely going to want to use a clarifying sh clar clarifying shampoo at least once every two three weeks depending on your hair type um that's my personal opinion i have to use clarifying shampoo twice a week or more um three times a week is probably the most actually so like one to three times a week my hair just is extra my hair is oily um actually this part of my hair is dry and my roots is all oily i don't know i'm like totally all over the place. The other clarifying shampoo I use, which I actually stopped using for a long time but started back up just recently, is my Neutrogena Anti-Residue shamp Shampoo. 
Um, and I love how simple this bottle is. Like, I cannot get over it. So basically, this you do not need very much of at all. It's like a syrupy texture, so it's kind of hard to work through your hair. You're going to have to do some effort, especially if your hair is really thick. Um, but you don't, you're not going to want to use this and this and and this all in the same day. Sometimes I com combine this together, and it works. And I also always, always, always use a conditioner because my ends get really dry and crispy and nasty if I don't use conditioner. I have my hair angled and razored so it's thinner. Um, if you guys ever want your hair thinned out, just ask your hairdresser to either thin it out or razor it because it's really the same thing. <laughs> That's my hair routine. Well, bye!